Fielding some questions here for Yosemite. I have a student who's asking me about how to get through UWorld without spacing out, okay, without procrastinating. I've made many clips talking about this here on my YouTube. How to get through UWorld without spacing the fuck out. And I have very fucking excellent advice here. So before we get started, please subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Give the video a like. I really appreciate it. Find me on Instagram at melman underscore medical. And the HLMAN underscore medical links down below. Find me on Telegram. The links to the Telegram group and channel down below. And I'll start the clip. So student wants to know how to get through QBank without spacing the fuck out. And I have very excellent advice here, which is you are going to do blocks of 10 in untimed tutor random mode, and you're gonna stick your phone in your fucking backpack while you're doing the blocks of 10. I'll elaborate. So, timed versus tutor, subject specific versus random, lengthy discussion, I've made plenty of clips talking about that here in the YouTube, but rather than doing a monotonous block of 40, you're gonna do, you're just gonna chop out efficient blocks of 10, and as I just fucking said, your phone's gonna be in your backpack, your backpack across the room, and you're going to do nothing but that block of 10 while you're engaged in it, okay? So let's say you're four questions into the block, and then in 2022, you go to reflexively grab your phone. You're like, oh, fuck, it's in my backpack. Well, you want to check your messages, okay? It's just what we want to do. Nope, you can't do that because you got to finish this block of 10 first. So you're actually incentivized to be more efficient and just get through the block, okay? It doesn't mean don't read, but you're going to just... Go through the 10 questions. You're going to be very efficient. And then at the end of the 10 question block, yes, I want you to go grab your phone, check your messages, have a quick bite, a drink, okay? Watch a YouTube clip or two. I want you to take an eight minute break. Then we're going to repeat the process. The phone goes back in the backpack and you're going to chop out blocks at 10 and you're going to notice that you're very fucking efficient. Okay, you'll be like, wow, I've already finished 30 questions and it's only been like 90 minutes. Like you'll be very efficient that way. And I'm not just romanticizing this process as some sort of contrived procedure. It's because I actually created it myself a decade ago when I was going through UWorld for 2CK because it was so fucking boring, I couldn't get through the QBank. So I just started doing blocks of 10 and that helped me get through 80 questions in a day. And so that's how I know that that's an effective strategy for students if they're ADHDing the fuck out. Now look, in terms of Timed versus tutor mode, subject specific versus random. It's a lengthy discussion, as I said. I think random mode is better because it means a lot more if you get a question wrong today and then you see a similar question three weeks from now. It'll create some shock value where you're like, fuck, I should have known that. Versus if you're doing all of the cardio questions, let's say over a three-day period, subject specific, you're going to have that info transiently in your short-term memory and you're not actually going to know whether you're reinforcing it truly, okay? So random mode allows for macro retention, macro retention. And then in terms of timed versus tutor, I think that you get a question, you have no fucking idea, and then instantly being able to see the answer creates shock value, okay? Versus you have to monotonously go through all the explanations at the end, and you don't have that same degree of shock value. Lengthy discussion, made lots of clips on it, but short point of consolidation for the sake of this YouTube clip is if you're going through QBank and you are ADHDing the fuck out, I want you to make blocks of 10 and untimed tutor random. Phone goes in the backpack, backpack goes across the room. And after each block, yes, I want you to take a defined break. You know the deal to make more content. If you like my stuff, subscribe my channel and I appreciate your time. That's it.